Hey guys, welcome to another video and thanks for tuning into this one. Um, in this particular video, I just want to use it as a way to encourage you to look closely and look at your life and see how you can, you know, change certain things, especially when it comes to finance. Uh, the reason why this is important is because we all watch all these finance videos on YouTube. We all see what people are doing and we try to learn from them. And that is a good thing. But what if we need to look within ourselves, right? To find the things that really comes naturally to us and find ways to actually get paid somehow, no matter how little, okay, from that thing. It's easy to look at these big finance or YouTube channels out there and see how they are making money, sorry, uh, from their channel or how much they're getting paid. It's quite inspiring and make you, you, you get envious of what their success, no doubt about that. But what if, what if you just need to be making enough so that your passion can really grow okay and i'm going to explain this in this video so when i first started this channel okay or this old youtube thing i didn't have a clue of what i was doing right and this is not a video for you to go start a youtube channel it doesn't have to be a youtube channel it just means find ways to let your hobbies all right fund itself and that is really i think it should be the title of this video and I hope I make it the title of this video. When I started this channel, I knew I wanted to talk about finance. I knew I wanted to, you know, share my journey, talk about the things that I read up I, I read on and what I learn, my mistakes. And I've shared those a bunch of those on different videos on this channel. And sometimes I'll talk about stocks, you know, and how to invest. And I think I still talk about those till now. But I realized that the struggle for me anyway, in my case, was that I couldn't really connect with the people that were watching my videos. And I think when it comes to YouTube, when it comes to building a community, you have to find a way to connect with them. But despite all my struggles through that stage, considering this is not what I do full time, you know, I would take time off, I'll take breaks because of work, because of just personal things going on. Despite all of that, my YouTube journey has somehow sustained itself and it is why i still come out here to share what i share it is why even though i may not get if you go check some of my videos i don't get any views at all and that's because for whatever reason okay those videos just do not, don't do well even though i've put a lot of effort but when you have the if you're not connecting with your audience youtube won't promote your video but if you're an immigrant, okay, and you have the ability to have constant internet, constant light, have a computer, you have the ability to let your passion be known. Now, it's up to you to then take that cross upon yourself. That means to be bold enough to put it out there. Now, like I said, it doesn't have to be a YouTube channel. It could be anything out there. And sometimes you don't even have to, you don't even have to put your face. You don't have to show your face. You, you may just be selling something on on, on TikTok or on Amazon or maybe creating something, right? Starting a business. It, it, it all depends. But find a way to let your passion show so that we don't all grow old, realizing that we spend all our useful time building someone else's dream. Let's try to build our own dream. It might take us a while. It might be slow for us at the beginning, but we have the opportunity to do so. Now, let me just show you something real quickly. Um, I'm going to share my screen here. And just like I said, this is not something. Um, this is one of the things that I do, right? I try to put my money into different, um, I guess, assets and see how they return. And why do I do that? It's because of my knowledge about you know, things like this. When I read, when I do my research, I bring it out here. And I've talked about this before. This is Prosper. And this is, you know, it shows how much my returns, what I've, what, what my gains have been so far. Now, that's not a lot of money. But again, these are some things that I honestly just try out, right? To see what uh, I get in return. This one, all right? This is something that I did or I found based on my interest, right? So 
I talk about a lot of pilot aviation related stuff on my other channel. And in the process, I found this uh, assessment website that people can use um, to to um, to practice for exams and prepare for their exams and things of that nature. And with that information, all right, all I have to do is share this information with the people that are interested, the people that I talk to about um, my interest, the things that interest me. And because of that, a lot of people that I've that have uh, been able to help with just this assessment website, I've been able to refer them to to the website to and they use my discount code. I get you know a few heroes here and there. But the point is, it adds up, right? But all I'm just doing is I'm doing what I would have done in the first place. But now the only difference is I have a platform that I'm sharing that information. The other one that I do uh, that I have is this is another one that I created out of just um, again. Let me share this one out out of um, trying to teach people. Right. I get to learn these things myself. And then, as you can see here, I've gained about fifteen hundred dollars on this one. And again, I'm not trying to show you this. This is this. This isn't a, this isn't life changing amount. Right. But the, the purpose of this is to encourage you that if you have a certain interest in something, all right, you can always use use that um, knowledge, channel that knowledge and find your own niche community so that you can reap the rewards. In a way, I am not making... You know, I'm not going to say that I'm making a lot of money from this. No, I'm not. All right. I wish I could be making a lot of money from it. That would be nice. But the point is, what I am able to get here and there is able to sustain. For example, this mic that I bought, it's expensive. I didn't, but I didn't buy it with my money. That is a good thing. The light is expensive, but I didn't buy it with my money. Right. The camera that is expensive, but I didn't buy it with my money. And so many other things that I ever, you know, the, and, and, and that is that is a goal. You let it just have its own life. All right. So when I started my own YouTube journey and started creating these ideas of making these videos, the intention wasn't for me to become, you know, an influencer. Right. Or to become no, no. I mean, it would be nice if it happens, but my goal was to reach a phase where it doesn't cost me anything other than my time, all right? And mind you, I'm already doing something that I'm interested in. This is something that I am genuinely interested in myself. Like, for example, I talk about all these pilot aviation cadet programs. I knew how difficult that was for me when I first started this journey to become a pilot. And that's why I took it upon myself to share as much as I can, whether I make money from it or not. But the good thing about life is that when you give value to people, somehow, okay, if you look closely, somehow you would get things in return. And not that, not that I've charged anybody, I haven't sold a course, I haven't made a course, which I can. I have so many ideas that I could launch, all right, to start monetizing some of the things that I do already. But I just don't have the time yet. And let me tell you something else that I'm doing. With the aviation course, for example, the aviation uh, channel that I have, I do this one-on-one -on -one coaching where I sometimes set up a class with people and I do that thing for free. And most of those guys, they've been able to get results with the information I share with them. And it's easy for me to say, you know what, I need to start charging everybody X amount of dollars or X amount of you know pounds or whatever. But I'm not doing that just yet. I'm not saying I'm not going to do it, but I'm just saying that I'm not doing that just yet. And that's because I do genuinely enjoy what I do, right? And that's because I want to, my, my goal is to be able to impart on these guys that are coming up in their 20s to hopefully, or in their early, early, uh, late teens, early 20s, and hopefully turn their life around so that they can go about saying they're happy they found me. And I can actually show you messages. Um, if I let me let me pull up some of the uh, 
let me pull this up here just give me a second and the reason why I want to show this is, is again it's not for me to I'm not trying to there's nothing for me to brag about right because it's it's just I'm just trying to encourage you that whatever your interest wherever your interest lies there are opportunities for you to um to 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 give value to people and if you can do that all right if you can do that good things will also happen for you uh if i just do this here all right these are all i'm not sure if you guys can see this these are all messages from different people and i'm just gonna scroll like it goes on it you know and i've responded to some of them right and the reason why i'm showing this is to let you know that i you know i try to respond you can see so many messages i haven't responded to and there's some here as well that i haven't responded to and these are people from this my community that i try these are one some that i haven't responded to six hours 15 hours something because it gets overwhelming and it's a lot of people that i try to interact with and this excludes the youtube channel where i get a lot of comments as well find something that you're interested in start talking about it know that these are areas of, of, of opportunity for growth for you because it takes a lot of uh, honestly it's not easy to come up here and share these things with you right especially when you're starting out it's not easy to believe that i'm going to spend x amount of dollars buy a computer buy a camera buy light and hope for success right it's all just trying to put the best foot forward and that's what i want to encourage you to do as well so do not be discouraged by or be discouraged by your uh, shortcomings right because nobody's perfect i am not perfect you are not perfect and and there's nobody perfect out there okay we are all just trying to put our best foot forward and that's what you want to do well i just hope to encourage you through this video and i would love to see you you know get to achieve your own goals no matter how little and no matter how big good luck to you